He's moved on already. It's not fair. No, it doesn't feel that way. Yet. We have a child together, and he's acting like he doesn't even care. How can I help you? I want to make him pay. I want to change my life and make him pay. That's not a very good goal. I don't know what to do. Are you done? I'm done. Are you done done? Like, are you done? I'm done, and I'm ready to move on. After this, there's no going back. Wonderful. Okay, number one, you need to get therapy. And if you can't afford therapy, you need to get a journal and a self-help book. Number two, you need to get everything legal. If you are divorced, great. If you're not divorced and you want a divorce, get a divorce sooner rather than later. Step three, as you have a child, you need to get a consent order, get everything legal. No, 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 we don't need that. He's a great father. He would never do anything, you know, weird. Yet, you need it to be legal, okay? Everything needs to be legal from here on out. You don't know who this girl's going to turn out to be. She might be the type of girl that doesn't want him to do pickups and drop-offs from your house. Wants you to, you know, travel all over the country to drop your child off. Oh, he lives locally. He'll never move away. Listen to me. The man that you knew no longer exists, okay? That means that you have to do everything in your power to protect yourself. Let me set the scene. A year from now, you're feeling real good, you've healed your trauma, and you want to go on that girl's trip. Ring, ring, it's your ex. I'm dropping him off. No, I told you that I'm going away this weekend. Don't care, dropping him off. Dropping him off, he's outside, and he's gone. You need things to be legal so that instead of cussing him out, you can simply call the judge.